Hey Bible lovers, I'm Tim Nichols. I'm here to bring you your Nichols Words. And today from Tyndale, I'm going to show you several new releases. Now, one of them is a re-release of an older text block, but it's still pretty cool. But let's start with the King James Version Wide Margin Filament Bibles. Now, you will recognize these from when they were released in the NLT. And because the King James is in the public domain, that gives lots of publishers opportunity to produce really nice editions. So this one obviously is a little more floral, probably a little more feminine, but it is pretty gorgeous. It has your floral pattern on the front, really nice green cover, and check out this decorative. I mean, that is just beautiful. Really well done. Now look at the accent stitching. That, that is next level, and that's something really nice to have in an economy Bible, because these are not that expensive. So then when you open it, this is one thing I love about Tyndale. Number one, you can see the reinforcement tape. Number two, you can see the vinyl liner. This thing is going to hold together really nicely. It does have a sewn binding. And this is an eight point font. And you have two inch margins that are lined all the way through. So these are all going to be the same text block. When you get to the New Testament, you are going to notice that the words of Christ are in red, but it's a really nice, deep, dark, burgundy red. So really nice. If you're into the King James and you like a journaling Bible and you don't want to spend a lot of money, these are some pretty inexpensive options. So now let's take a look at some of the other covers. And again, I won't show you all the text blocks because they're basically the same. But I just think these little symbols are nice. This is really a pretty cover. Look at that. It's like a marbled mahogany kind of, just that marbly look, beautiful symbol. I'm not exactly sure what that symbol is, but it's really nice encased. It's just gorgeous. So well done. And these are not real leather, so these are not going to be that expensive. And then there's a hardback, and I thought this was really cool. This is the wide margin, and the hardback comes in a slip case, not a two-piece box. And this one actually has gilded page edges like the others. And it has like a stamped in. I mean, that's just beautiful. Really nice. And again, hardback. So let's go ahead and take a look at this one. This one has a paper liner. You can see that it is reinforced taped. And you can see it's the exact same text block. Each of them come with one ribbon. I haven't untucked that one. And then lastly, this one is a little bit more of a nice one. This one is in the genuine leather. Tyndale makes very nice genuine leather. It kind of has the simplistic spine. Now this one doesn't have all the decorations. It's got the grain of the leather in it. And of course, this one's going to have your vinyl liner. Let's you know it's a genuine leather cover. And of course, same text block. So these are really sharp. And I'll tell you what, if I was to pick a favorite out of all of these, I would have to say that one is my favorite. Even though the genuine leather is probably a little bit nicer on a scale of materials, that is just a beautiful cover. And I'm telling you, I don't mind this one that's a little more feminine. I'd like to see one of these in all green with that design because that's quite pretty. So now let's take a look at a couple other things they have out in the NLT. These are premium value compacts, and don't let the word premium fool you. These aren't premium Bibles. These are very inexpensive, and they have a sewn binding. They have a pretty nice little fake leather cover, paper liner. Now, this is a whoo-wee small font. That's a little bitty font. So that's something to keep in mind, but again, if you want something that you can just toss in your pocket, you want something you can toss in your purse, this is really nice. And then they have one that's in a little bit more of a feminine cover, and it's floral, really pretty. No gilded edges, so you're not going to damage that. No ribbons, no extras. It's just almost like a pocket testament, only it contains both testaments. Finally, they've upgraded the super giant print. Now, look, brace for impact to the genuine leather. I've actually reviewed this one before in the economy cover. I will put that video on the end screen. Are you ready? All right, here we go. Open up 16 point font. Boom. Now, to give you some perspective, <laughs> this is a seven point font. Wow, that is a big print. So if you're having eyesight issues and you want a nice Bible, now this is a big boy. It's got your translator notes in the corner. And then of course it's got your filament enablement. If you don't know how to use the filament Bible, I'll go ahead and put that on the end screen as well, but it's not that difficult. And when you get to the New Testament, of course the words of Christ are in red, really dark, Really nice red. I don't know the GSM of any of this paper. This feels thick-ish. I would say probably 33 would be my guess, but really nice. And when you get to the end of Filament Bibles, of course, you're going to have your extras with your Tyndale verse finder. You're going to have your visual overview of the Bible that kind of gives you maps and the different plagues of Egypt and all these different things. But the really beautiful thing about all of these being filament enabled, including the compacts, is that you can download an app on your phone, the Filament application from Tyndale, and 
you can ultimately pull up commentary, notes, maps, videos, everything to kind of help you study. This is incredible stuff. And if you like the King James, there's all kinds of new releases. God bless you. Keep calm. Jesus on. This is your name's worth.